hi guys so today we are making a new video today i am going to teach you guys how to tie on waist but before we get started please like comment and subscribe please so i tried to get the best angle where i thought that you guys will see clearly what i'm doing so first i want to show you guys the waist beads that i'm be tying on so i'll be tying on three waist beads so uh, the first one is our goddess waist bead the second one is nez nez has actually been discontinued from the website for now but it will be back later in the year and then a more of course because valentine's Day is coming we are going to start with um a more so once you get your waist bead so one end will be the knot and the other end will be the uh, extra thread so what i do i push some of the beads so that we have extra thread on both and i feel like it's so much better then you will put your bead around your waist or wherever you want um your waist bead to stain so see we have a lot of excess so usually i'll measure exactly where i want my um waist beads to be um and then you always make sure that you leave a little bit of space so i want mine to be right here leaving a little bit of space at least one inch because if you don't leave space as soon as you eat something that's it like your belly will get bloated and yeah we don't want that so i want my waist to sit right here give myself a little bit of space then i'll make a knot you make a regular knot as if you were tying like your shoelace or something there's nothing difficult about this so you make the first knot and then you pull make sure that it's very tight i usually make about like three to four knots some people will burn the end but i don't because i feel like once you, if you have like good knots you don't really need to burn the end so i don't burn the end and my waist bead lasts long but if you want more security go ahead and burn the end so once you have your knots and you feel secure you will cut the excess and this is where if you wanted to um, burn the end you would but like i say i don't burn my ends and my waist beads have been fine so i'm going to tie the other two so like i said uh, i move it so that we have excess on both ends excess on both ends put it around i measure to where i want my waist bead to sit measure 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 okay once I found where I want my waist bead to sit, I make my knots. One knot, two knot, three knot, four knot, <laughs> and I'll make a fifth knot just for the road. If not, just for the road. Take my scissor, cut the excess. This is what I have so far. And I'm gonna add my last one. So adding the last um, waist bead. It's not my last waist bead for the year, but it's what I'm starting off for the year. I always start with three and end up with like 10 to 15. But it's okay, it's fine. Making my knots. Making my knots. I'm gonna see through this. Okay, so now that I have my three waist beads on, 
hope you guys can see i have a little fupa maybe we're gonna work on it this year we'll see but just want to show you guys how it looks from the side from the front well thank you guys i hope you enjoyed the video like i said don't forget to like comment subscribe if you have any questions don't hesitate to let me know on all, um on any of my social media classy buyer everywhere and visit my website www.classybaya.com thank you guys bye